Welcome to our photo journey through the haunting remains of Eastern State Penitentiary, once home to infamous criminal like Al Capone. We enter one of the main cell blocks, where rows of the cells stretch out endlessly in the both directions. One cell almost entirely collapsed reflects the ravages of time and neglect that have befallen Eastern State Penitentiary, the peeling walls, broken ceiling and the crumbling floor reveal the age of this nearly two-century-old structure. The delicate beauty of butterflies contrasts sharply against the cold stone walls of the prison. One of the most intriguing artifacts in the museum is mummified cat, discovered in 2015 within the prison walls. Likely trapped and starved, it twisted remains a haunting symbol of the isolation that once defined this place. In 2019, the remains of an egg-bombed American robin were found inside the walls. The bird met the tragic end unable to lay its egg, a metaphor for stifled lives of many who were incarcerated here. In 1929, Eastern State became the first prison to house infamous gangster Al Capone after his arrest. Despite the prison focus on harsh isolation, Capone's cell was unlike any other. He lived in a relative luxury, a testament to his influence and wealth. Eastern State Penitentiary isn't just known for its role in prison reform, it has also made its mark on the world of entertainment. Its haunting atmosphere has been used as a backdrop for numerous films and music videos, the most famous of which is 12 Monkeys starring Bruce Willis and Brad Pitt. All monkeys. Characters played by Bruce Willis and Brad Pitt in Psychiatric Ward. The TV room scene is most iconic from 12 Monkeys. Monkey Rows of patients lost in their own minds stare blinky and single television screen. Not just a place for psychological thrillers, Eastern State also played a role in blockbuster action films. It served as set for Transformers 2. In 2001, Sting chose the penitentiary for a haunting photo shoot for his album cover. Also, backdrop for 1988 Return to Paradise movie. In 1985, Tina Turner filmed part of her music video for One of the Living. That was just top of the list. Another unique exhibit here is a transparent radio, designed specifically for prisoners. This delicate object built to prevent inmates from hiding contraband inside. Despite being a major tourist attraction, many parts of Eastern State are still in state of disrepair. The museum operates under the Preventurine philosophy, choosing to remain the site that this was found rather than restore it completely. We arrive at one of the death row cells. Dark and foreboding, this small room would have held the most dangerous prisoners, those for whom there was no escape except death. Even now the cell feels claustrophobic and final.
Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this tour, like, comment and subscribe for more videos. See you next time.